Hello everyone, this is Direwolf20, and welcome to episode 5 of Glacial Awakening with Soren, who uh, is staring down at me as I am in this hole. I mean, I logged off the server, so I can only imagine what you did is decide to say like, oh, that's where Dyer logged off, so I'm going to make sure to make a nice hole. <sighs> I fixed the hole. I, I can see that. Yeah, okay. I'm, ass I'm assuming that this 2x2 two two of water down here is, you know, of some purpose to you. Either that or you just you just wanted to make a little it, troll. The troll. purpose was you locked off here and I didn't okay. want you to die when you fell in the hole. Fine. Okay, I'm very clear on that point now. Well, I like the wall that you <laughs> built. It looks very nice. Jeez. Lovely wall. Lovely wall. Very nice. I decided to stop with there rather than like going out 80 chunks. I mean, that's fair. Mostly because getting snow for this is not the best mission in the world. Yeah. To make snow blocks, you can't craft them. You have to do the little compacting thing. So I went through a couple shovels. Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay. Fair yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. However, we have a torch grid. I want this torch grid to exist. You are not allowed to put down a machine and move a torch one block. Why? Because it's a torch grid. It, okay. It's perfect lighting. There's no mobs that will spawn here. You move a torch, there will be probably mobs. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Ha have you played with uh, the building gadgets torch grid mode? Yeah, once or twice. It's kind of like the, the partial checker board. Right, but it's perfect for torch grids. Tor torch, yeah. torch grids. So that would have been really handy had we had glacier uh, uh, gadgets, but you know we, we don't have it. You know, I absolutely considered, like, pulling a Tema and be like, if player name equals Direwolf20, then give building gadget, but... That would be, like, really awesome, especially since you use power, and it would have just been like, hey, I have this thing, I can't use it. I mean, I could have I applied the MBT data, right? Like, gadget that is fully charged. You're playing auction 9 and like, I'm running out of power slowly! Yeah. <laughs> However, uh, what is our mission today? Well, I, I did one quest without you. I saw. You made a bed. I made Monster. a bed. Yeah. I'm going to think I know. Yep. So I can set my spawn. And also yes. because it's nighttime. And also to test that how many people need to sleep thing, which I see is, you know, not a stupid number. So we're good. Yeah, I didn't change that by default. So I'm glad that we're playing with two people. Yeah, no, I like it. I like it for sure. Uh, cool. So we've got. Uh, so t so today, what are we on? Oh, we got a satchel. Nice. Which satchel is that? That's the CUFH Vanilla Plus satchels. Yeah. So you can open it up. You can also hold Shift right click and configure it. So I have pick up only snowballs. Um, you can deposit it into a chest. Interesting. Oh, I see what it is. So it's. Is that made by COFH or is that like an add-on that somebody made? Because it's basically the COFH satchel, but it uses vanilla. It Maybe might be an option. Add -on. But it says it's a different know. different mod name underneath, so that's interesting. Right. Yeah, but that's that's straight up like the standard satchel mechanic, right? Yeah, that's a that's a it, built They might vanilla. have separated to a different mod, so that way you can play like vanilla and just have the satchels. Right. Which is a cool idea, by the way. Mm-hmm. I like that. I want to play a pack that's just like lightly modded. It's, it's vanilla, but just a little bit of sprinkles. Yeah. With filling gadgets in it. Obviously. That would be like adding syrup, but sure. Okay. Well, building gadgets has a config option to do durability instead of power. Oh, I know. So, like, you could do that. And you uh, can repair. We have some stone now. Top Yay. left of the. Lots of Probably. stone. Good job, Soren. You did good. You did good job, Soren. Good job. Yay. Yay. Because last episode we wrapped up, we were going to make a combustion heater. So I need gunpowder. Uh, gunpowder, which I assume we've at least killed a creeper once, right? Possibly. I have. I didn't get gunpowder from it. Oh, fail. There might be a way to get gunpowder, though. Maybe it is killing the creeper. but uh, So there's nitrate, sulfur, and charcoal. Uh, probably none of these things are what's up. I should go kill a creeper then, huh? There's a way to get gunpowder from combustion, but that's what I'm trying to make. 
Or you can put crushed flint into a freezer. Interesting. Oh, we can get gunpowder from a ghast. Interesting. Hold on, I think I have one of those hammers, don't I? Oh yeah, crushed flint. Where's that little hammery dude? That's I will go sword. get the uh, blocks from down there. Cool. The the thing that you hammer things in? Yeah. And get the freezer too while you're at it. Will do. Because it looks like I can make gunpowder with this. I kind of like packs where like you have the option of, of you know finding a way to not have to go like hunting for monsters to get the resource you yes. need. Like, obviously, you know, getting lots of gunpowder would be easier to go, like, kill a bunch of creepers, but if you just need to make one and there's a recipe that works, that's kind of cool. Nice. Good job with the strainer stuff, bro. I... I'll come back in. I'm going to leave the uh, magic stuff there, just because I don't know if I break it, it comes with me or not. I assume it would, but... I mean, it, it, it was so early to our progress that I wouldn't even be concerned if we had to recraft anything. Right. Cool. All right, what you got for me? Uh, so we have a um, interesting. This is not active now, but if you want to have a, if you want a lot, of, if you have a lot of potatoes, you want to cook them. Mm -hmm. You put down tinder, you put down some logs on it, and then you light it on fire, and then you just feed it like a furnace. Ooh. And, and I get, get lots of uh, lots of potatoes, huh? Did you get that freezer yeah. and the and the plate thingy? We'll have to hit. Yeah, hook me up with them. There. Or, no, or put them wherever you want. Fix this later. Okay, so if I want gunpowder in this pack, uh, I can. So one becomes three, and I need sixteen. Okay. That should be cool. And that should be cool. Nice. Gunpowder is mine. So that gets me a stone combustion heater and a stone casing. I like this mod. Like I like I like sky resources. It's another one of those variation on a theme, like we talked about last episode, right? Like when you play a sky block and you're always playing with X Nihilo, which is an amazing and great mod, after a while it's just kinda like I've played this mod like so many times at the start of a sky block. So having alternate sky block startups is kinda cool, right? And sky resources is one of those. It's just yeah. You know, it's not better or worse than, than X Nihilo, right? It's just, hey, here's another option so that, like, things don't get stale-ish. You know what I mean? Yeah. It... <laughs> I want more variety with mods, but it's hard to get. It is. And to be fair, like, people, people feel like they shouldn't make this mod because it's too similar to this other mod. And I would say, like, yeah. don't, don't be afraid to do that, right? Like, initially, people would be like, hey, like, building gadgets. Like, why would I want that? I have a builder's wand. But then it's like, okay, I could see, like, that's kind of cool. So just, if you want to do it, have fun. That's what it comes down to. Just, even if, even if you don't know that your mod's going to be super popular, just do it for fun. I honestly don't think you should ever try to make a mod to be popular because... You're just going to be frustrated later. Right. You're extremely correct about that. Okay. Place down the stone casing. Right click it with the stone combustion heater to insert it into the casing. That's right. And you have to make like a, a pseudo multi block structure here, right? So this goes here and that goes there. And we've got that, right? Multi block not formed. Correct. So then I've, I'm trying to remember what it is, but it's kind of basically just a plus sign from what I remember, right? Yeah, so you just put stone around this and middle block is... Oh, that works. Yeah, right. I think it. I think you want it to be stone, because it's like... I think it's smooth stone. Uh, cobblestone works. Does it? Okay. Yep, multi-block formed. He's happy. There's like, there's a button you can press for help with this mod. And I forget what it is. It was just a normal button. Yeah. So one gunpowder becomes three blaze powder. So I'm going to want more gunpowder. Which I think I can make from that thing, can I? I think flint in there turns into gunpowder. I might be wrong. I'm correct. One flint equals three gunpowder in the combustion, dude. And, and there's a button involved, too, somewhere.
And then we need a fuel source, which I guess wood will do for a fuel source. Yes. Yay. Sorry. Now you put wood in there, right? What'd you do? Put one log? I put one oak wood, which is 300 ticks, so... Right. So that gave us 300 heat units. Right? And that gave us another 300. Okay, so this guy's lit. So then I think I... If I remember this mod correctly, and I'm pretty sure I do, I just drop this in. Now this makes gunpowder, and it requires 1120 heat units. Well, that's a problem for us, buddy. You know why? We have 600, yeah. I agree. So that ain't gonna work. So, what model was this? Uh, it's only 75 to go from gunpowder to blaze, though. So we need gunpowder. We need gunpowder the way I made it a minute ago. And then we can get blaze powder from it. Because we need blaze for the quest. Sky resources, I think, was the mod to answer your question. Mm -hmm. I realized that was actually what we were talking about, so I just went and typed it. <laughs> so to get three blaze, we need one gunpowder. So I basically need two gunpowder to complete the quest. Isn't that what it is? Or am I crazy? Oh, it's a pickaxe. That's cool. And that's cool. So if it's only 75 heat, I should have no problem crafting two of these at a time. So we drop this dude in here, we cover it back up, and then we hit the button. Oh, the heat leaked out. Oh, right, because I opened the... <laughs> because you opened it, yeah. Um. I remember now. <laughs> Mechanics, yay! Oh. That's fine. That's what happens. Quest complete. Yeah, when you when you hit the button, there's an explosion sound. Efficiency meter. Right click on a strainer base to measure its efficiency. So I'm gonna keep saying zero percent. I know. Self checking yourself like that's not great. I'm clicking on you. Well, that's not how that works. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, that was the joke, Soren. Thank you. Okay, so that works, right? Um, so breaking the heat, the block on the top loses the heat. But there's things you can do. There's blocks you yeah. can make. There's like a combustion collector. That'll collect the item's output. And then there's like a quick dropper. That's what we want. So that requires glowstone and iron, which I don't think we've figured out how to make yet, right? Glowstone can be made with redstone and blaze powder. Redstone can be made with gunpowder and blaze powder, so that's cool. I'm hoping that we get easier access to gunpowder sooner than later. I'm hoping that's what we're going to go for. I mean, it's nighttime now, so we could hunt. We could. I'm looking at... Uh, oh, I see. Okay, so I want four of those. Okay. I can make this. Just need four clay, and then I should be good. Good, 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 good. Have we found clay? I thought we did. Yeah, there's like a whole there's a whole layer of clay, right? Yeah. Beautiful. And then I want the stone kiln. So that's going to be a masonry brick and some more masonry bricks. So that's just, we make stone brick slab. Is that the only way you make it? And a pickaxe. So presumably, I'll get this many, and then I'm going to put you there so I can do this. That's pretty cool. I didn't math out how many I need because, I mean, it's stone. We should be able to get more if we need to. Hey, I found a meteor from AE2. <laughs> nice. Works for me, dude. Creeper. I will kill you, Creeper. Boop. Hey, I got that furnace thingy, the stone kiln. Ooh, okay, nice. Yeah. So how does this work? Do I, presumably, I just right-click fuel sources in there, and 
and then a, a top piece. There we go. Hey, cool. I'm making, uh, okay. I'm making, I'm making smooth stone, I think. That ain't too shabby. Burn time zero. Oh, well, that's a problem. Uh, let's let's do these things. So if I put them in there, recipe fifty. Do I have to light this with a fire starter of some kind? Uh, hey, that seems to have worked. That did something. That was a good guess. I wonder if the rest <laughs> told me that. Nope. What are you doing? Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait I'm for waiting. it. It turns it into charcoal? That's cool. So, like, you literally just light charcoal on fire or wood on fire and it turns into charcoal? That's neat. That's pretty cool. What mod adds that? What mod adds that, Soren? Do you know? I am unsure. Uh, I know it was used in Volcano Block, but I don't nice. know which one. Cool. Well, I got heavy ingots, so that's a thing. Oh, in world no. And look, I was given pants. We have pants now. We have pants now. Oh, we have Yay. fancy pants. Pants. <laughs> I'm eating some of your potatoes. Fair. Oh, I made them. Cool. So now you want me to make an empty rod, a crushing block. Which needs a block of those, so we have a lot more smelting, and a mist rod. Which, a rod filled with mysterious soul fluid, which doesn't have a recipe. So that's a concern. Oh, uh, so you, you take an empty rod and you right click. Oh, and that's it? And that's it right. uses part of my soul? I don't like the sound of that. Hold right click to use, and yes, it does take part of your soul. I mean, like, which part? Uh, whatever part you would actually bind to a piece of armor. Mm, okay, if you say Have so. Have fun. We're gonna stay over here where it's safe. I would I would recommend that strongly. <laughs> Just I'd like to keep my right arm, my left leg or alternate left arm, right leg. Yeah, left arm, right leg. <laughs> Been a while since I've watched it. And then you must have to stay away from any kind of small dog or small child. Because they can detect you no longer have a full soul? No, they'd just be inseparable. Oh. So I should stay away from you? Is that what you're saying? Or I, That would be wise, too. <laughs> 300, I think, is enough for two of them, right? Maybe not. Oh, because my gunpowder came out. I picked it up by mistake. Yeah, if you're quick, you don't lose all the heat. Okay. So that will get me a bit more of those. Sweet. Oh, I see. You put charcoal in there. Nice. That's why we have such a long yeah. burn time. That's cool. Yeah, I figured the wood would not burn very long. No, no, it definitely did not. I also like how it kind of smelts it all at once so like the more stuff you put in there the longer it takes to smelt but then you get it all at once that's kind of cool that's a neat mechanic i'm trying to decide if i've seen that before that's really cool so okay gotta... uh the freezer as an yeah. example. Yeah, the freezer does that, for sure. 
No, I meant like in terms of smelting, though. Alright, so I needed a crushing block. Which needs my smooth stone back. Huzzah! And an empty rod means one more heavy nugget. Oh, rip. Hmm. <laughs> All right, so can I see that crushing block? Uh, this one? Mm -hmm. Yep. Should I be watching Jesse. what you're doing right now, or? Oh, I'll wait for me. You can go ahead and do what you need. You know, stretching feels fantastic. Oh, sleeping all day is also something that was nice, almost. I hear it started that. raining here as soon as I started taking my nap. Almost I would very much clean. like to uh, to get the thing that makes gunpowder easier to make. We need we need a higher casing. I think it's the casing. Yeah, the casing increases capacity. Right. Yeah, max heat units 950, 1538 from iron. So if we got iron bars, we need six pieces of iron, and then we can have gunpowder uh, from combustion. How much gunpowder do you need? I mean, I think I'm good for now, but it's just right now making gunpowder okay. is many steps and a lot of resources. And once we upgrade right. this, it will be far fewer steps with far less resources. For now, I think I'm pretty good. I just need to make one more of these and we should be cool. So I put that in and, oh, now that's interesting. It's all, that's cool. So the, regardless of the number you put in there, it's the same cook time. Because one took 50 seconds, and I think that's about how long that, like, eight that I made a minute ago took. So while that cooks, show me what you want to show me. So the crusher uh -huh. crushes, imagine that. But you have to do it in world, so much yeah. easier since we have carry-on. We can just pick it up and drop it. Oh, well, that's nice. Cool, <laughs> and we got stone dust from that. Hey, yeah. that's cool. So what happened, like, if I do that... Ah, nice. yeah. So that you can that's do that the way you're supposed to do it without carry on. Okay. Yeah, it, that was one of the things in volcano block. He actually added that. He had it in volcano block, and it was kind of specified. You might want to just pick this up because it's right. rather slow to mine it. Cool. Now, do we have sand? I don't remember getting that. I'm curious if there's a way to get sand. Compacting bin, sand pile, uh, gravel, and grinder. Gravel on the grinder? Which one's the yeah, grinder? Yeah, the grinder one? that you used. You got gravel with the first time? You're thinking I remember that? Which one was the grinder? It was the little hand tool. Not the anvil. No, no, this thing. Oh, that thing. Oh, right, 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 right. Yes. I remember him now. <laughs> Too many mods. It would I would have remembered eventually. <laughs> I would have remembered eventually. One day, <laughs> one day, Dyer will remember a thing. It might take a little time, but he'll get there. Hold right click to use. Okay. So I'm gonna smelt up this guy. Uh, get some glass, and then. So what's the stone dust all used for? Uh, mysterious fertilizer, which is cool. Or I can use it to make a stone dust block. Place near water will eventually become dirt. Oh yeah, I remember that. We did that already. Sweet. Okay. Ah, see, so yeah, you have you used to have to strain it. Okay, cool. I want to see what the other crushing recipes are. So, all right. So the mist rod, oh, turns into mysterious dust. Okay. Episode twenty-three. Dyer remembers the rock crusher. <laughs> I know. No, I'm looking at your crushing. The thing that you like place on top of and it drops and falls and breaks things oh yeah we can use that to make bone meal from bone shards we can also get glowstone from that Ooh. yeah we have a couple of glowstone more in this pack it seems it feels like less right we, we have, have a little bit less. from breaking flowers and we can get some from witches right I don't know if there's another in this. <laughs> Me neither. I guess we'll find out. Prison the light. Ooh. 
All right, I'm holding right click. Ow. Ow. That hurts a little bit. Oh, rod build is serious. Cool. Okay, cool. So three, three iterations of clicking that equaled over the thing. Yeah. Rock core and seed of life. I'd probably recommend the rock, rock core first. Yeah. Okay, cool. Crystals. So how do I get these crystals? I assume I need crystal blocks. Okay, crafted from a mysterious mixture and then smelted. And the mysterious mixture rod. is mysterious dust with leaves around it. And the dust, I think, was a crusher from this rod. Okay, cool. Yep. And these mysterious leaves come from a mysterious sapling, which is fertilizer around a sapling. Got it. Okay, so I need, I need four more dust, and then I can make enough fertilizer to make the sapling. Right? So that means I need more of these dudes, which I think I've got enough. Just need more blaze, but that'll be easier to make soonish. Don't cool. look up. Don't look up. <laughs> what happens if you drop it on me? I'm curious. Go ahead. Nothing. Oh, I'm really disappointed now. <laughs> okay, good. PVP still on. Just wanted to test. You never know. It might have got turned off by itself. I'm just saying it might have happened. <laughs> Angry villager sounds. Yeah, definitely. Very uh, much. Do you want to crush that rod that you have? Uh, sure. I need more, but yeah, no problem. Thank you, sir. So I need a few more of those, but uh, I'm gonna let's come back in a minute because I need to I need to like get more gravel and more. Uh, sand to make more glass so there's a lot of smelting in my future so i'm gonna take care of that real quick make some sheer all right we're back guys because soren remembered something that he wanted to tell me about yeah, remember something so bring that mysterious dust over here okay uh one second let me just add this to my to-do list okay so i've got the mysterious dust so this is explained right in the next quest box. right seed of life would give us access to making uh, grass, but we already have grass in our area, so now we can do this, right? Create mysterious grass. This mysterious grass will slowly grow plants that can be harvested for an infinite supply of more mysterious dust. Boom! Sweet. Grow. Yeah. I wonder if a watering can would work on that. Uh, I think it does. It's just... I also slow. am curious if it spreads to other grass. So, the funny thing is, it's theoretically supposed to. It's okay. just really really slow <laughs> if gotcha. it does because we waited about 30 minutes and it didn't okay but it is supposed to it's supposed to i wonder if it's because in volcano block you're in the nether biome right i have no idea okay that could be yeah no okay yeah that could be related i don't know i'm not sure about that So I want heavy snow, right? Is that what I want for this? Yeah, but I need four. Okay. So. And then this goes in there. So it's basically a stack of snow. One stack of snow exactly to make this ice crystal, which is needed to make another crusher. Which gives me that. Hooray! So using that way, uh, you don't have to make more rods to get mysterious dust. So. Yes, but the problem being is you have to wait for those plants to grow, right? Right, so it, it kind of winds up being that you get more mysterious dust, you use that to make more. Um, How long does it take this this bush to grow? And Not too much longer. Is that is that fully grown or we have to wait? No, nah, it's a little bit more. It's interesting because if I look at it at F3, it doesn't seem to have a metadata to it. Hmm. Right? There's no block attributes. Is it a different block though? Uh no. Still mysterious nope. bush. You sure it doesn't you sure it needs to grow more? No. 
It will spread? Uh, okay. So there's two blocks in JEI, Mysterious Bush and Grown Mysterious Bush. So maybe it does turn into a totally different one. Though it does say that Mysterious Bush drops Mysterious Dust, according to JEI. And the Grown iteration also drops Mysterious Dust. I think it grows one more time. Okay. I am just reporting what I'm uh, saying. Did you take the shears out of the thing? I did. Do you need them? I do. Okay. I think we need these to harvest the plant. I don't know. Did you get... Okay. No, wait. I, no. Where'd my things go? I made heavy ingots that were probably smelting. They're in the materials chest. The second chest on the left. Ah, cool. Thank you, sir. I'm still okay, okay at sorting thus far. <laughs> I'm impressed. I'm impressed. I'm very impressed. Next episode, just there's like 30 chests more and then none of them are sorted. <laughs> Doot, doot, doot. So, I've got some things. I will have uh, three of these empty rods now. Pick that up for me. Go, go ahead. Thank you. Very nice. Okay. So then the mysterious dust I used to make mysterious bone meal. And if you need wheeze for anything. And then I combine that with a sapling. Ah, you need. And I've that. got the mysterious sapling. Okay, I'm gonna plant this over on your on your tree, magic growy thingy. Okay. Hey, guess what? I can't plant it on your fertile soil. Wah, wah, wah. Rip. Can only be planted in bonsai plants, according to the tooltip. Oh, well, there we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so bonsai is reef factory bricks from Pyrotechnic, which is a smelted on fired refactory brick, which is a combination of clay, ash, flint clay, and slaked lime. Wow, that's a lot of things. <laughs> that's a lot of things, Warren. I'm gonna hang on to you for now. Um, are you such that I, I can I can make at least one? Yes. So your resources chest. So we have all but flint clay. Oh, slate sign. That's different. Quick line. We have some ash. Right. We we can get everything that's here. It's just. Yeah, I need more. Soaking ash. pots, different masonry brick board. Board. What? Oh no. Burning items, huh? So I can burn planks to get ash? You don't need a bonsai? Mm -hmm. I just read the tooltip. If it plants on grass, cool. I'm, I'm just telling you I'm right-clicking on grass and nothing's happening. I, I believe you. <laughs> just, yeah. Do you want just it? Looking at my chat, that's what they said, and I was like, okay, sure. Here, I'm giving it to you. You tell me. You tell me if you yeah. can click it somewhere. Uh, let's see this one. That's a plant of mysterious. Oh, you know what? <laughs> yes. Hey, it does spread. Hey, look at that. Oh, good. I'll wait for this one to grow and then. So I get six of these per craft, and I only need five. So that's cool, actually. Uh, so clay, flint clay is crushed flint in a soaking pot. Oh, hey. Uh, so this is what it looks like when it's fully grown. Yes. Yes. That's what J uh, J I looked like. Yeah. I cannot plant it on that. Rip. Do we have a soaking pot yet? No. Do we need a board for that, it seems? Uh, okay, yeah. No, I agree. That is craftable to us at the moment. We can make one of those. Is it? Yeah. How do you get a board? Or do you need a stem sawmill? Oh, never mind. Yeah. Okay, that's pretty easy to make. Yeah, it's all easy. I have some of the resources for it, so I'll just make it. I'll knock it out. Okay. So, you guys. Well, that's it? Okay, I can make more. 
Uh, do you have more dust by chance? Uh, yes, I have three more mysterious dust. Do you want it? Could I borrow one? You can have them all. Oh, okay. Yes. I'm a nice guy like that. Let's come back after I've done this. Be right back. All right, Soren, I got the stone sawmill. But you said you I got, got a, tree. a tree. How'd you get the tree? Yep. So we plant down normal sapling and we used mysterious fertilizer. Oh, so that's a thing. Yeah. Okay. But that still doesn't let us place our mysterious sapling, so we still need a bonsai. Correct. Okay, Correct. cool. So then I'm going to continue with my process of making that. So I just put a soaking pot needs four boards, which is planks in this thing. Oh, that's a fuel. I don't want fuel to be in there. I want you. Stone sawmill. Well, I might have to make the saw blade. That could be. That could be. I have fire. What could go wrong? Do 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 There you go. All right. I'm making the thing, Zoran. Look, it's working. Oh. Uh, where's my Ooh. lighter thingy? There it is. I have to light it. There it is. Look, it's oh, cutting. Oh, it spins so fast. It does. It's like, look how fast I'm spinning. I will be done in one minute. <laughs> How is it spinning that fast, I wonder? I mean, it's being powered by coal. Okay. Coal is magical. The entire factory condensed down to one block with perpetual machine. Magic. All right, uh, I gotta wrap up the episode though. So uh, let's wrap up here and we'll come back next time to, oh, look at that, it's even thrown a pile of wood chips on the ground. Oh no. That's cool. It's kind of neat, and you get a pile of wood chips, which can be used to make potash mulch, or other things, apparently. Wow. That's kind of cool. Thank I like you. that. Yeah. I like that mechanic. All right, so next episode, uh, we'll come back. We'll continue our quest line here, but the main thing we're working towards is the cores for ores quest, right? Which requires an, a block core, which requires a crystal, which requires crystal blocks, which is basically smelted mysterious mixture. What'd you do? I do? I, I broke the tree. Cool. Was it loud for you? There was a loudness, but I don't know if it was your tree breaking that was loud. That was the excavated, probably. It might have been the stone sawmill, because it sounded like it sounded like a saw cutting. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I need more masonry bricks, which I can probably get from this, maybe? Nope, of course not. Why would it be that easy? All right, wrapping up point, double 20, signing off. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. We'll come back next time. For now, take it easy.